I want to look for in the security logs, right? So we go by our index. In the security in the security logs, I want to look for event code 4688. Okay, so we already talked about that, 4688. But I don't want account names that start with the star. That's system stuff. Okay, I'm looking for any time someone used the at command or BC edit or chcp or cmd.exe or cscript or ipconfig or memicats or mbtstat or netcat you know or netstat or he tried to run nmap or an nslookup or bcp or sql cmd or osql these are tools that, that hackers often use when they try to attack databases inside of your environment. I want to see if people are using Ping or PowerShell or PowerCat, which is the PowerShell version of Netcat. Are they doing PSExec or installing the PSExec service or installing the PS Tool Suite? This is something a lot of attackers do. Are they running things like ProcDump or RAR? Right? You're going to find a lot of attackers when they get on a machine, they'll RAR up files. Are they making registry modifications, right? Are they running the route command? Are they doing run as, right? Or scheduling and trying to manage services or scheduled tasks? Are they trying privilege escalation with like Seth C? Are they installing something like SSH for Windows? Are they running sysprep to try and get credentials that we use for network installs? Are they running like system info? Right, system info is how you get like patch data and configuration data. Are they running net commands trying to see if they can enumerate the network or trace route or VSS admin or who am I or WinRAR, WScript or WinRM, right? Are they running WMIC commands? Right? Now now what you're saying is this is what I want, and I want you to print it out in a table format. And I want you to give me the host, the account name, the process name, the process ID, process command line, the new process name, the new process ID, who created it, and a short message. I know that's a whole, whole lot, right? But I think when you see it, you're going to start to see why you want to run complex searches like this. It's just so much better. Because now we're digging through our log files and now you're starting to see it. Wow, there's my cases where it ran ping.exe.